Hey, how are you all doing? And welcome back to everybody who's different today. We're back on Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts. It's a Sunday, I know. Merry Christmas, happy holidays to you all. I know it's a bit late, but I just thought I'd take a couple days off just to spend it with the family because you know how it's been this year. Got to make the most of the time you get. So I hope you guys all had a good Christmas um, celebrating whatever you may have done. And I hope that 2021 will be better for all of you, but we can talk about that next week when it comes up to New Year. Um, today, obviously, back on Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts, we're doing a bit of a... Stir. Fun, random little thing. 10 light cruisers versus 90 destroyers. Who will win? Light destroyers, massive number advantage, massive tech, a disadvantage. 1935, 1920, starting at 14,000 meters. Blah, 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 blah. You know the drill. I just want to say, guys, before doing it into the video, you've been absolutely smashing it with all the new subscribers recently. Um, I mean, my channel's only been a thing for about seven months and we're already almost at 1,000, which for me, that's unbelievable. Only something like as of recording this, 26 more, which we might be able to do in a week. So please, guys, if you are new around here, please subscribe. It would mean so much to me if I could get to a thousand subscribers before the start of the new year. That would be amazing. Anyway, let's get into designing the ship and doing the battle. Let's see what we can do. Light cruisers, light cruisers. So that is a destroyer hull, which I find funky. Because they have the experimental cruiser. Um, that's a funky hull as well. I don't really know. How big's the biggest light cruiser we can do? I don't really... The problem is I don't really want one with the whole lowered back part, you know? So maybe I'll go with that one. Is that German? Oh, no, it's not. I don't think so. Okay, we'll do that. We'll go for this one. Um, well, I guess we're doing all the standard standard stuff. I don't know why I went to Spain, by the way. It was just, why not? Uh, I definitely bought maximum bulkheads. Triple that one. That one. Because we're just going to get slammed by torpedoes. Range can go down. Speed. You know what? I'm probably going to lower it to 30 knots. The question is, do I want gear tail or do I want diesel? No, I'll go gear. Gear's always better. Oil induced. I need to be able to turn away from them as good as possible. Crook four. Barbette three. Now, Lidite two. If I took Lidite two, super heavy. The chances of me having a flash fire, massive. But the chances of them getting absolutely ruined by HE damage is oh, it's good. I like that. Okay, we'll go for that. Torpedoes, no. Autoloads, electrohydraulic, gentle radar, nah. sonar three, coincidence five. Oh, Citadel. Uh, fine. Oh, you know what? No, four. Four. Funnel. Uh, not, I'm going to try the one and we'll see how much we have. 100% perfect. Okay. What do we do? So we can have a maximum of seven inch guns. So we go seven inch? Or do I go for more rapid fire? Because we're starting at 14 kilometers. So maybe six inches is going to be the best. Because it gives me just enough range. I think I'm just going to go triples because volume of fire always seems to be better than... Re you know what, could we go for an Atlanta sort of style actually? With 15 inch jewels. Go for the ultimate... Atlanta, can I run them down? Can't even get another one in. We're going ultimate Atlanta here, Jesus. Can we, there we go. 
And then up here, out there. Barbet. Oh, we can't get the barbet. Oh well. I think it, yeah, but the Atlanta had five inch guns. That front end is just so ridiculous. Ugh. Um, the question is though, do we remove them all and then instead go for six five inch triples because we just have so much damn room? massive four-way offset we need to add I need to get pushed all the way back um, if we take the triples and then put them on the side like this okay now we only got a little bit of four-way offset left I've got halfway offset. We need to move these forward a little bit, okay. Not point six, that's fine. I can do that. There we go. Looks weird. Um very weird. Means I can't move that forward anymore because then it goes into that bloody part there. Ugh. Um, I don't think, I'm guessing that if I put one of them in there, it's just, just, just no real point is there. And then I got rid of them. I could just do that though, and that kind of sorts it, 0.1%. Don't know. There. Um, well, yeah. Okay. I don't know. I've got so... What? I don't... Oh, I don't know. Okay. All right. Um, guns on the side. There. And there. And there. And there. Do you reckon we have enough guns? Um, let's think. What do we, armor wise? Forgot that I needed armor. Um, if we put that four. Yeah. Three. Two. 
Kong Tower like five. Turret four. Oh no, there are a lot of turrets to be fair. Hmm. Uh, do I need tw 27? That's still a reasonable speed. And we can put that up to like six inches then. I can go up to six inches. I can go up to about four inches. No, I can't go to four inches. I can go to three inches. Um, maybe 2.5 times inches. And I can go up to two inches. Uh, I can go up to four inches. Uh, 3.9 inches. So top can't go up. I didn't get any secondaries. Oh, well, actually, you know what we could do? There we go. <laughs> right, so uh, according to my maths, we can have a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So a 45 gun, 5 inch broadside, if everything is perfect. But I doubt that gun's really even going to be used. But oh well. So maybe like a 42 gun broadside, which I think is pretty damn good. Uh, what we might do is just right there. I think that's going to be that's going to be pretty pretty good, but it could also be absolutely terrible. So we'll wait and see how this ends up going, considering there are 90 of them, 90 destroyers. On top of that, I, oh dear. Oh dear. Oh. Well, you know what, we're gonna lower the speed down to full. I feel sorry for that destroyer, I'm not gonna lie. I wanna be kiting away, really. Um, all right, so that one, go into there, just put them all in together. Speed, take it down to 22. <laughs> it's so wild. Uh, put it onto HE as well. Who's the lead now as well, by the way? Oh, Miguel is. Miguel over here is the lead. There we go. I put it for three times. Go on. More fire. Yes. Fire. Blow her up. Maybe I needed bigger caliber guns to use uh, HE. But, um... I'm going to turn it back to AP. Partial pens. Come on. Overpen. I only seem to be able to get over pens and partial pens right now. Oh, no, there we go. Yep, yeah, go on. Go on. Let's just let's just sink sink it. There we go. There's one down. Uh, only 89 more to go. Eighty nine more to go. Um Okay, so if we open that up, I'm going to select each of them. I'm just going to see if I can't just kind of open what is being fired at up to get as much damage around as possible. That one. That one. That one. That one. Uh, that one. So now if I just select it, yeah, we've just got firing all over the place. And what I'm hoping is that maybe it'll just kind of... I don't really know what I'm hoping for, in all honesty. 
Or I could just go like that and go like that. And you're going... What? They're all going so slow. I feel sorry for that destroyer, I must say. Well, I would if we could actually hit anything with them. Over pen. What? The amount of shells that are going all the way around right now. Yep, there's two down. <laughs> We're switching fire over to this guy. Now, how long is it going to be before we get our first torpedo hit on us, though? Oh, torpedoes are away. Turn. Do you want to do some proper damage? Oh, that's not going to be pleasant for you. Go straight now. Oh, we'll smoke up as well. I mean, they're not really doing anything. Uh, you are going to die. You're going to die. Unless I press play. No, you're dead. You're dead. You're gone. I'm sorry, dude, but you're done. Yeah, he's, he's done. I'm very sorry. Um, you're going to be done because I can't... I don't know. You're going to get hit by it. Yep, there we go. You're going to get by one. Because they're all just mongs. Right, just put AI on and let them do their thing. Because I'm kind of losing my mind with what the AI is doing. Because they're all just sitting still. There we go. Let's let the AI do their thing. Let's see if they can actually get out of this. Nope, he's dead. Yeah, we... Uh, yeah. I may have made a slight error of judgment hit here. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Maybe the AI... Because the, if the AI is on, then it will try to dodge the torpedoes as best as possible, which might mean that we actually are able to do something. But now that half my bloody light cruisers are done... <laughs> it's just so many. Jesus Christ, another one. Why wow, so many overpens? Just sink it. Really? Like, I don't get how we have just such terrible accuracy. Yeah, we do have 17,000 rounds. Like, the amount of guns we actually have shooting at it right now. At this range and we can't hit it properly. This is wild. Giacinto Cadini. With its single four inch guns and stuff and torpedoes, so many torpedoes. No, don't let it get away! Oh, it's just gone so badly. Yeah, you know what? I do think that six inch guns would have been a better option here. So, I'm actually going to try it. We're going we're gonna to rebuild the ship. And we're just going to get rid of all the guns. I'm going to put six inch guns on. Sometimes less is more. And we're going to get rid of that in the process, apparently, as well. Okay. Let's 
So if I move that back a little bit. Maybe I'll go for a mixture of sevens and sixes. So I'm going to put a seven there. Seven there. No, not well. Can I move that forward? I can. And then can I fit? Nope. Okay. Okay, we'll fit a seven inch further up. And right about there. And now we'll take six inch guns, but I'm gonna take dual sixes. Can't fit on the side unfortunately. We are off. If we take six inch guns here. And we want jewel. I think we must. It's a difficult one because it's difficult to fit them in. While also fitting in the sevens. Okay, we have six. So maybe we put a six inch jewel up there. Yeah, because in order to actually fit them in, I need to move that literally all the way up. Uh, can I move that one a little bit back? Well, that doesn't look right. But oh well, we'll go for it. If we slap now some six inches. Can we fit them anywhere? No. If I do that, they fit. Oh, only one fits. Well, unless. Oh yeah. So I've made them fit somehow. If it works, it works. Now, I think we'll probably grab four inch guns. Nope. Three inch guns. Nope. Really? Two inch guns? And then some five. So I want five, uh, no, five inch jewels around here. Very massive aft weight offset, but I can't move that in anymore. Can I move that one out? It's just a massive aft weight offset. Um, can I grab some six inch jewel to put in there? Like that. Kind of cancel it. And then bring that in a little bit. No, oh, can't bring that in a little bit. Uh, it's so difficult to bloody do. Unless, take seven inch, put it up there. We just go for that, and then instead we go for six inch jewels all along here, yeah, like that and that. Like that. Like that. <sighs> like that. No, I just have to move that back a little bit. What if we do something like that? So we've got a bit of everything going on. We got some big guns to try and do some heavy damage. And then we could just slap on extra armor, I 
Uh, you know, what if we don't? What if we put on extra speed? Thirty knots. Are we still one hundred percent? We sure are. Okay, let's try this. Let's try this. See if it will do any better. If not, I'm just going to go for all seven inch guns and hope for the best. And then I probably won't hit much. Jesus Christ, guns. Oh, this has started off terribly. Let's just put 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 the AI put put the AI on. AI command is on. Let's just let them do their thing. Over pens. So we're still Lidite 2 uh, super heavy shells. And we've already got torpedoes coming in. Because you spawn four kilometers away. I swear I set up for, four t for 14. I think I set it up for 14 and somehow we've had some spawn for four kilometers. Right, you know what? You know what? I'm just going to restart the battle. Because. That's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> Come on then, now let's do it. Much better, they're all actually away from us. Let's speed it up a bit. The Ile de Luzon, the Blas de Lezo. No, these are all, are these French? No, these are, these are Spanish. Ile de Luzon. No, I'm just saying it. Why I, I'm saying it in an Italian French accent. This is terrible. Oh wow, we're doing more damage than I expected to it. Jesus. What's doing all the damage? It's the six inch and seven inch. Surprisingly, the five inch doing absolutely nothing. As we oh, oh never mind. How much? Jesus Christ! Destroys us for nice resilient bloody things in a game. It's wild. Do not run away. Don't you dare. Speed. Do it. Do it. Come on. Kill him. Kill him. Ooh. Look at the amount of shells coming in. It's absolutely ridiculous. I swear we've got so many floodings and nothing has happened to his flooding. What is going on? Can this guy actually flood? Like, look at this. We've had like four flooding and it's just not doing anything. Oh, no. There we go. Did you launch some torpedoes? I do not know. Can we actually do something? Jesus, how many hits are we getting on this guy? There we go, you should die. There we go. Flash fires. Yes. Oh, we love flash fires. This appears to be doing much better than the previous 5 inch Atlantas that failed. Go on. Go on. No, please sink it. Please sink it. No, please sink it. No, please sink it. No, sink it. Sink it. Sink it. Right, we're taking AI command off for now and just making sure that something is firing at it. Kill it. There we go. Now put AI command back on. <laughs> You're getting very close and I do not like it. How is it getting so close? Oh my Jesus. Okay. Our detonation. Never hurt anyone. We've just got a firing line set up now. Uh, let's just... I wonder if I can just... Dunk and... Dunk. Just raining shells now. This is good. They are, I think, further away than last time. Yeah, they're over 14 away. 
So where do my six inch guns stop? Five inch, six inch. Oh, we have got we have got them coming forward now. What are you doing? You're just milling around over here, are you? We have got look at this, they're all coming towards us now. This is getting worrying. Just get it. Here, there we go. So all I wanted is that one to be all guns be firing on that one target. Everything's going. Come on. Come on. Let's you got ten of you. Come on, let's melt it. Go on. Oh how have you managed to let it get away? <laughs> now this 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 is bad. Is bad. What's. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is going to be dodgy. 1.3% chance to hit is uh, iffy. <laughs> come on, all of you, come forward. Okay, so how are we looking? You just... Uh, can't, it's so difficult to bloody kill them. Look at the amount of damage we're doing. It's just not going down. Go on. We. It's not going to die. Not going to die. Yeah, you got torpedoes away. More torpedoes. They're just so difficult to kill. The flooding isn't doing nearly enough to them. Quick as well. Triple bottom. But they've only got anti-flood one and look at how good the anti-flood is on it. And they've only got they've only got auxiliary engines which help with flooding. And anti-flood one. And look at how damn good the flooding is on it. It's wild. Destroyers, but then whenever I use destroyers, they're just down in a second. <laughs> Torpedoes that you've got. Uh, we've got a four and a single, 19 inch. Come on, do some damage. Do some damage. Come on. Come on. The amount of guns we are firing at the moment and we're just not hitting it. Come on, here we go. A bit of flooding never flipping. Good, thank you. Go on. Oh, torpedo hit on one now. And I think it's gonna get away again. Infusted fire, we're over here now. Torpedoes are away on that one. We can't seem to kill them before they even get away, and then it switches target again. So hold on. Turn that off. All guns. Fire at that. You know what? Put it all on aggressive as well. Sink it. Good. Now switch to that one. Go on, flooding. Come on, flooding. Let's. There we go. Now it's doing stuff. We're into two two inch gun range now, which is kind of worrying. Right, dead. Good. Switch fire onto that one. It's getting iffy. That's for sure. Oh, torpedoes away. Will they be able to dodge it? Put it onto AI. You're dead. There we go. Switch fire to that one. Come on. <coughs> do it. Do it to them. Flooding. It's always good. Yep. Big damage there. Good. Come on. We've only taken one torpedo so far. Come on. Ammo detonation. Perfect. There we go. Right. Oh, wow, you're coming in close. 
almost in two inch gun range. But he might die. What's the range on your spear? It's 9.3. Can't be only one hit by a torpedo, which is good. <clears throat> Look at the amount of damage it's taking. Come on. Oh, managed to get a torpedo away before it died. Let's see if I can't get them to come back in because they're all running away a bit too much for my liking. Jeez, the seven inch guns are almost already out. Bloody hell. We're going in close. Come on. Um, Velasco, you are shooting up there, good. Will it go down? That's no, no, it probably won't. What are we doing? No, oh, you. What, what? No, you're supposed to go that way. What are you doing? I don't even see any torpedoes. Oh, screw it. Go back onto AI. No, we're definitely not going to kill 90. I don't even know how many we've killed as of yet. Um, I, I would count them but I really can't be asked because there's 90 probably about 80 70 78 probably something like that <laughs> and this one's still alive not gonna be much longer anyone anyone gonna come in and see what they can do Okay. Go. Go, 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 go. Come on. Let's speed it in now. Uh, we'll lower the... Yeah, uh, Velasco, detach you, you, accurate, speed down to 24 to give them accuracy bonus. Want all fire on that one. And uh, we'll smoke up. Now let's have a look at what happens. 7 inch guns, almost out of ammo, 99 left. Come on. Let's actually do something to it. You're 7 kilometers away. Come on, do something. Do it. I'm just alive for so long. Stop being alive, it's not allowed. over here, the big, the big group, let's switch, switch, no, go for the big group, please, oh wow, they are in close, okay, never mind, switch fire back over to them. I did not see how close they were. And we're out of ammo on 7 inch. We've got someone left on the 7 inch, some left on the 7 inch. Okay. 
To do some seven inches still firing. Go on. Yes, that is some big damage there. Will the flooding sink it? It will. Put AI back on now. Torpedoes. No! <clears throat> Alvaro! I will um, avenge you. Yeah. Oh, look at this. We've got, is that, we literally got 410 hits. 410 hits out of 38,000 shots. That is insane. So, from what we can see here... <clears throat> The six-inch guns are probably the uh, the most lethal because I mean I know we've probably got more. Uh, let's let's compare actually. Let's compare. I'm not really sure how many because seven-inch guns can't going to do any more damage now really, which is one flaw. They don't have enough ammo. Five hundred and ten a gun, four hundred a gun. Okay, fair enough. They do have probably quite a bit of ammo, um, and they did quite a lot of damage. So we've got six guns versus. Um, lots. One, two, three, four, five, six on a broad. Uh, so twelve on a broadside. So maybe seven-inch guns are the best for what we're doing. If we look at the uh, what we've got, seven-inch guns have had one hundred and twelve hits, but done twelve thousand damage. But the six-inch guns are two hundred and sixteen, fourteen thousand. But there's also twice as many of them, and they're in jewels, so they're more accurate something to think about. Five inch guns just suck. Do not like five inch guns. Uh, six inch guns are the way to go. I think that's what we've learned. Six inch guns definitely the best. More torpedoes. What? No, you're meant to be turning away from the torpedoes, you stupid. I told you to turn away, satellite. I turned you in and then told you to turn away, but you kept turning in. Um, what are you all doing? Why have you all gone absolutely mental? Why have you all gone mental? <laughs> oh man, I don't even know what they're doing anymore. Either way, guys, I'm just going to leave that there for today. I hope you've enjoyed this little bit of a just uh, a random video where we learned that 5-inch guns are far better, are far worse than 6-inch guns. Uh, just in my opinion, that is. You guys might love 5-inch guns. Don't really mind. Either way, guys, hope you've enjoyed. And, yeah, I'll leave you on a shot of the Blast de Lizzo firing his guns away. She's a beauty, isn't she? Magnificent. So you guys hope you enjoyed. See you all in the next video.